Hi, I'm Zach Marshall, personal trainer at Prairie Stone Sports and Wellness Center. And what I want to share with you right now are the benefits of walking. Now, the benefits of walking, uh, there are many. Uh, sometimes I'll just think through the benefits from toes to nose because there are benefits for your body from your head all the way down to your feet. So we'll start up high at the brain. The walking has been shown to have beneficial impacts on cognitive ability or your ability to think. Things like memory, coordination, etc. cetera. Uh, other benefits for the brain, uh, reduce risk of depression. Uh, some research studies have looked at exercise as an aid to people who have depression and those research findings have been very significant. Uh, moving down, we, there are benefits for your heart. Uh, reduced risk of heart disease. Moving down a little bit lower, uh, blood sugar. Your blood sugar is uh, controlled in part by physical activity, including activities as simple as walking. Moving down a little bit lower, we have digestion. Your body is aided uh, in its digestion by activities like walking. We go down a little bit lower, we have the joints, the hips here, and your joints are aided by walking because what happens when you walk is you uh, move what's called synovial fluid, which is lubrication for your joints, and that helps uh, lubricate your joints and keeps them healthy. We could keep talking on and on about the benefits of walking. There are so many uh, that we could be talking all day. Uh, now, the how-tos of walking, how fast should you walk? How often should you walk? The Center for Disease Control recommends at least 30 minutes of moderate physical activity, which includes walking, at least five times a week. Now, moderate intensity is defined as walking between 50 and 70% of your maximum heart rate. That's basically brisk walking, or walking at a point where you're able to talk but not sing. And this walking can be done in chunks. You don't have to do it all in one uh, fell swoop, 30 minutes straight. You can do it in chunks of, say, 10 minutes or 5 minutes. And that will, be, uh, that will give you just as much benefit as walking for 30 minutes in a row. So those are some of the benefits of walking. I hope you get out and walk on a daily basis.